안녕하세요, Marie. I'm Federer Elias, and I'm here to do the paper plane interview from, of course, inspired from my song, I'm a Santa Paper Plane. So, without further ado, let's get into the paper plane interview. Very nice folded, by the way. Essential. What is essential for me is the music. Without the music, what is life? Because music uh, gives me so much joy, it gives me comfort, it makes me feel safe, it makes me be able to express myself, share it with other people, and love my job. Next word is goal. My goal with uh, music uh, is and has always been to connect with as many people as possible and that to make people's lives better. If I can make your life a little bit better with my music, then that makes me very happy. And another thing um, goal can mean is, for example, yesterday I watched my football team Manchester United. They beat Manchester City because they scored two goals and Manchester City scored one. So GG Man United. Okay. Inspiration. I have a lot of things inspire me. For example, when writing songs, it's like what I'm going through at the moment, what my friends maybe are going through. Movie and suddenly that sparks some inspiration. Walk out in the street and you hear a word, a conversation, see something like whatever can spark a song. First album. So my first album is called Love and Loneliness. It felt very good to release my first album because it felt like kind of the first stage of my career that I think here in Korea is like seven or eight times platinum, which is insane and it changed my life and I'm so happy to be, to be able to come here and I love that it makes you feel a lot of things as well. Five, I think, or number six, Korea. 사랑해, Korea. I don't know if you can do this thing where like yeah, BSS uh, they taught me that you can say like, for example, my name is Peter and then someone can say Perange. I don't know if that works with Korea. Can you say like Korange? And I like yeah, Korean food, like Puradak chicken, downtowner hamburger and Korean barbecue and Takalbi, Takalbi. Takalbi is also very good. And yeah, so many cool artists and I've been so fortunate to meet a lot of them already. And yeah, just a very cool and lovable country with lovable people. Ooh, Alan Walker, the Norwegian EDM pop genius. And uh, yeah, we released a song together in January, together with Putri Arani. The song is called Who I Am. Yeah, that was a very cool and fun experience. I've been wanting to collab with Alan for a long time actually, so now it, it made sense, which uh, was very fun. And meeting and getting to know Putri. Yeah, shout out to Alan Walker. BSS, another group that I collabed with, Bu Sakson. Sang Wan Hoshi and Do Yang, I miss them so much. It was such a great week when I got to go here to, in uh, Korea and do the promotion with them. They like Korean televisions like the Inkigayo and the M Countdown. And yeah, just hang out with them and so many fun moments. Uh, so one of the better weeks of my life and I can't wait to see them again. And who knows, maybe we'll collab again sometime. The box is already filling up. Jungkook Nora Jarang. So this TV show, I was on the first time I was in Korea ever. And everyone is like, why is Petter on that show? Like, what is going on? But yeah, the reason I was on that show was that I wanted to do something like a little bit different than the other, other artists. He even sang in Korean, because I remember I sang that. Cause your love is so sweet. Yeah, you're my everything. Don't let me tan yeah, very fun experience and so crazy to see the reactions in social media afterwards with so many people sharing and commenting and writing kick, 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 all the time. Happy. Okay, I'm gonna say three things that makes me happy in the world right now. Number one is my fans. I love them over everything and they give me so much and I'm honestly so, so grateful for them and that they make it possible for me to do what I love the most in the world, which is make music and share my music and share memories through the music. You guys make that possible, so thank you so much. The second thing is the music. I've always had like a lot of music inside of me and almost everywhere I go and like almost 24 7 I think about music in some way or another or I sing or I write or I play or uh, listen to it and a world without music for me would not be a happy place and the third thing is good food quite often the best part of the day is just enjoying a super good dinner together with uh, someone uh, that you care about that makes me very happy collaboration 
my artist project, then it's very fulfilling and energizing. Like giving to collab with other artists, because then I get to sometimes, you know, you're not like alone in a release, kind of. You share that feeling with other artists. They're like here in Korea, for example, collab like uh, release music with BSS and uh, lucky to like meet Chauno and Le Seraphim, The Boys, Dio. Hopefully I will collab with many more Korean artists in the future to come. Loving you, girl. Always like from the first line in the song, I'm kind of, I travel to like a specific place and it makes me feel something. I love that you guys are vibing to it and just love coming here and singing it with, together with you guys. That's the best feeling in the world. And I know you don't want me to stop, but I only have one paper plane left. So let's see and make it count. Debut. My debut song that ever came out was in 2018 in August and it's called Simple. And a fun fact about that song, which I kind of cringe a little bit about today, is that I even added like a little rap. And I'm not a rapper at all. That is like, I like you, baby, you like me. How much harder than that does it really have to be? And when I listen to it today, I just go like, oh no. But that is a fun fact about my debut single. Ah, oh, okay. Thank you. Kamsamnida. Another surprise. Marie Claire Korea. So cool to be given this opportunity. I think they are so cool, inspiring for so many and to see all the beautiful photos and the content and the magazines and everything they put together. It's uh, very inspiring and I can't wait to see when all this is getting released and to see how you guys feel about it. Yeah, very happy to be here. Kamsamnida. Sarangeo. Bogo shikoyo. Annyeonghaseyo, my Korean fans. Goodbye. I love you very much and I can't wait to play a concert here later this year, so stay tuned.